we try to to play this perspective of Jesus in the story in a in a different way in, ter in terms of we using a lot we use I try to use a lot of the relationship between Jesus and children for instance every time we have children on set we try to interact with with Jesus and 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 with the children because I think that was one of the purest form of relationship it's when you can't fool a kid you can't lie to a kid he can tell and 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 I think Jesus, in a way, um, had to be someone that connect with the pureness in in the purest form. So we use that a lot. And the, the, what I got as a as an actor and as a person from that interaction was way more special to me than the biggest things that happen on set. You know, that was the pure magic working uh, through me and with me. There was nothing else beside a huge studio and location, location, location to shoot. Um, it was tough because it's we were in, basically in the middle in the middle of the desert, uh, so extreme heat, extreme cold. Uh, as as soon as the sun goes down, it's like freezing cold, um, and we had to shoot it. And obviously, there are certain scenes that helped the weather in Morocco. It helped a lot. Uh, because um, part of the story, it's about suffering <laughs> as well. It's sacrifice. So we, not only me, but the whole the whole crew and the cast members, the the gang, the disciples, uh, we faced it as, as a as a part of the experience of, of doing something that is it w it was tough. We try to make it as, as truthful as possible and, and in a way kind of almost like raw. Uh, obviously, we had this I ideal, this uh, almost angelical image of Jesus, but the truth is it was, it was dirty. Uh, we, weren't, we weren't, I mean, they weren't, weren't supposed to be as clean as we, we imagined. So for Jesus, for instance, we try to we try to dirt him up a little bit um, in terms of the skin, not not be always super clean and, and beautiful, raw. When the wind came in and the, the 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 hair it's covering his face, it would be natural, and and we wouldn't we, we weren't trying to clean it up and make it more beautiful or or sharp or clean or angelic or whatever. And I think that's a plus in terms of of the storytelling. I had actors on set that was not supposed to be shooting. They it were it was the her his they their their day off, and they were there just for support. So this can show you uh, the spirit in the environment that was on set with with the cast members. Uh, it was something really special, and I I really appreciate that. And uh, we were like a. We called it. We, we we were the we were a gang, and but again a good way, obviously. And having actors that was supposed to be on their day off on set just for support, it's not common. It's rare, um, and uh, it it makes a big difference. Uh, when I when I when I when I realized that that was happening, I got really emotional, obviously, because I saw I saw their commitment and their friendship and uh, that's rare. When you have someone uh, then uh, the only goal is to make this project, whatever you're doing, the most amazing project ever, uh, you're definitely in good hands. <laughs> you know, you know that everything that it could be possible uh, would be what happened uh, and and it, it is different because we're not just telling a story of in this particularly this project it's you're not telling a story <clears throat> a straight story you know this is a, a complex and 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 unique story that touched people for 2000 years 
and basically shape and change the world as we know it. So you need to have someone willing to tell the story again, once again, and bring something different. Um, and that was that. That was what I felt when I when I when I sat and I, I and I talked with Mark and Roma. They they wanted to bring something different, uh, improved, updated uh, to the the story that they they love so much.